¡Ey! ¡Muy buenas! ¿A que parezco una cabra? Una cabra lechera No es una cabra cualquiera Bienvenidos al episodio 4 de Tales from the Borderlands Lo habíamos dejado en una parte muy interesante Habíamos encontrado, o más bien nos habían encontrado a nosotros Los dos buscacámaras protagonistas de los cuatro que había de Borderlands 2 Se habían llevado a nuestra querida... Uy, le di a la sin querer A nuestra querida amiga Atena Y también, pues, nos había encontrado la, la tipa esta... La que tiene... Es que... Es que... Es que no sé cómo definirla, ¿no? Es fuerte, machona, dura. Esa, esa tía que no nos había metido por culo. Searching for the robot's missing components gave the former middle manager the chance to quietly reach an accord with the demented ghost of Hyperion past. <laughs> the dream of the vault seemed closer than ever. Unfortunately, any dream can quickly turn into a nightmare, and this nightmare's name was Valerie. Fortunately, Valerie's killing spree was interrupted when another dangerous adversary was suddenly revealed as a powerful ally. Now, supported by a legendary gladiator, their search continued through the icy wastes of the borderlands to a forgotten Garden of Eden. There, they found another piece of the Gortis robot, as well as the last surviving man on the Gladiator's murder bucket list. The con artist said nothing as the Gladiator prepared to take her revenge. Lucky for him, it was that moment that Valerie chose to strike. Outgunned and outmaneuvered, the con artist and salary man were forced to surrender. Now, They were working for Valerie, and their first job was likely to be their last. Nos la metió bien dobla. Vale, una cosa, le voy a dar a pausa porque hay una cosa que me está tocando lo... las pelotas, ¿vale? Ya está, ya hice lo que quería hacer. Problema resuelto, por lo que parece. Era una cosa de, del sonido que... Que no, no, no sé, sonaba raro, sonaba como un pop, un pop, 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 pop. Oh, awesome, yeah, let's, let's do that, can't wait. Are you thinking? Yes, it looks like you're, you're thinking. That suit he's wearing, it looks familiar, but I, I can't place it. Yeah. What the hell is this guy getting out of all this? I can't figure it out. This endless march down memory lane. There's gotta be a reason for it. He wants a vault. Why else would he be collecting Gordas pieces? He's just like every idiot on Pandora looking to strike it rich. Aren't, uh, aren't you kind of, you know, vault hunting now? Are you calling me an idiot? Yeah, that's what I did there, yeah. I feel like we should do something. If we get to those hills, maybe we could lose him. Yes, I don't know. What's he gonna do, huh? Shoot us both? <laughs> I seriously doubt that. Don't be stupid. He has a gun. So? He clearly needs us for something. If he wanted to shoot us, he already would have. <laughs> I think all those shots to the head are taking their toll. But that hasn't helped. I'm making a break for it. And you should too. Remember, <laughs> zigzag when you run, okay? Hit up. Makes you harder to hit. That sounds stupid. It's not stupid. It's it's genius. All right, going on three. One, two. Vamos a hacerle caso, aunque seguramente. Oh. En zigzag. De verdad, tío. What the hell was that? I don't know. Meteor shower. Get to the shelter. Oh, God. Oh, God. Whoa! Whoa, 
shit! Oh. That was close. It was, wasn't it? <laughs> What's no that? Bomb. Uh, this again. Clearly, I can't trust you two, so you just gave away Gordas. She was taken. And you were stuck under Valerie's gun. It was a rocket launcher, okay? It was massive. Even for her. Vaughn? Vaughn! Shut up. Oh! Hey! Oh. Stop it! Please! Not so rough. Yes, ma'am. There, there, little one. No need to be upset. I'll answer your questions. Please, just promise that you won't hurt anyone. Can of course, this? dear. I don't want to hurt anyone that's being mm -hmm. cooperative. Don't trust her, Gordas. Oh, don't listen to her. She's just being sore. Besides, if you don't tell me, I have to start hurting people again. And you don't want that, do you? No! Now, tell me about the Vault of the Traveler. The, the Vault of the Traveler teleports all over the universe, only staying in one spot for a few minutes before blinking away. But... Once I have my last piece, the beacon that's up on Helios, I can summon the vault and hold it here. Then you collect treasure or something. What does the beacon look like? I... I don't know. But I'll know it when I see it. That's what happened with the last piece. Well, that's some exciting news. Thank you, Gordas. You're... You're welcome. Can I get away from you now? Of course. <laughs> Look at you, Fiona. Just so angry. <sighs> Is this about Athena? You're feeling Athena guilty. Wouldn't hurt anyone. That's what. Leave her alone. You can't blame yourself. Athena made her own bed. Where did they take Athena? It seems Lilith and the Crimson Raiders have some questions for her for what your friend has a long list of heinous things she has to answer for <gasps> enough about <sighs> athena let's talk about what you and your friends hey hey what are you doing with him there's no need for guns i've come to strike an accord a what what are the terms it's rather simple, really. I turn over this Hyperion number cruncher, and you allow me to return to my work unharmed. I knew we couldn't trust you. That's all you want? Yes. I just wish to be left alone. I don't understand. What did Vaughn ever do to you? Nothing. Just as I have never done anything to you. Yet, you hardly hesitated in offering up my life to pay a debt that you know nothing of. But he said... You've got a deal. Ah, all right, all right. Then I shall make my leave. I will remember this. I suspected you would. Vaughn! You all right? Ah, uh, I've been better. Now listen up. Under normal <laughs> circumstances... <laughs> Your rotting corpses would already be getting torn apart by skags right now. But these are not normal circumstances. And with that last piece being on Helios, I can't think of a better crew than a pair of Pandoran con artists and a Hyperion stooge to figure out a way to get it for me. What do you say? And I'll give you a hint. The only right answer is... Yes. This is not a negotiation. What's in, no us, mata, what's in it for you? Well, for starters. <gasps> <gasps> things like this will stop happening. 
Does that work for you? Uh, or do you think we should negotiate more? Uh, hey! What's it gonna be, Fiona? Uh, somebody take this out. Hey, you said you wouldn't hurt anyone. No, I said I didn't want to hurt anyone that cooperates. Stop, yes, whatever you want. Please, just... Just leave him alone. I'm glad we were able to work this out. Patch up the nerd. Don't want him bleeding out on us. Oh, great. Getting dragged away some more. I should be getting used to this by now. <clears throat> Son. Yeah? Be a dear and help them come up with a plan. Yes, ma'am. Let's get cracking. Bueno, pues parece que nos vamos de viaje. I'm telling you, it's not possible. We can't do this. That's not an option. Neither is getting ourselves killed. One way or another, we're going to figure out how to pull this off. <sighs> okay, let's start with how we're going to get there. Well, okay, okay, This isn't the on. first time we've had to get creative. Look, I know well, what we have to do. Thank you. All right, guys, it boils down to this. Somehow we've got to get to Helios, infiltrate Hyperion, and steal Gordis's vault beacon. Sorry, that was breakfast. <clears throat> Sorry, without getting ourselves killed. No shit, moron. I just said that like 30 seconds ago. Everyone knows what we have to do. We're just trying to figure out how to do it. Okay, okay. If you stop being so negative, maybe we can make some progress. How's your tum-tum there, buddy? That'll one. teach you to hit the I taco do, truck. Right now, I don't see how that's gonna happen. Wow, you we'll got the magic, kid. The they should there bottle the so stuff. Call it weak sauce. And that's why we have to drill down on no, no, sure every aspect of the mission. In there so somewhere. We just, just gotta keep looking. I'm not the one forcing us to go on a suicide deal, mission. Just I hope stop you, calling you help me, but you're constant shit-talking isn't helping anybody. You've got to face reality. Oh, Reese, you see, you just so sadly mistaken. It's helping me pass the time inside your stupid little tiny walnut head. Then maybe try coming up with a few solutions. Walnut head. I like that. Walnut head, walnut head. You know we can't do that. So listen, Fine, I hate to be the bearer of good news uh, here, yeah, but if there's one thing know, you know about me, it's that I'm a collector of my rival's top secret now? project. That's why I'm going to share this juicy little tidbit with you. So once upon a time, a few of my guys bought, yeah, borrowed an Atlas shipment that contained parts for one of their top secret projects. You got the beacon. And about a zillion other Atlas gizmos, too. That's the best deck in town right there, especially their freaking guns. Oh, man. I got, I got this one with a fist attachment, so you can literally punch someone in the face before you shoot them. <laughs> yeah, what I'm saying is this, I got your beacon somewhere in my office. Get in there, and it's mission accomplished, baby. I just don't see how we're gonna do this. You don't get that beacon. You're all as good as dead. You're not Gracias. Oh, great. Captain Obvious wants to speak. Uh, I believe I have some information that is relevant to your interests. The beacon is in Handsome Jack's office. You pulled that out of your ass. Well, check it out, smart guy. Run it by Gordis. Fine. Hey, put the little robot on. Listen, you got access to a map of Helios? Yeah, I do. See if you can focus your scan for the beacon in Handsome Jack's old office. Let's see what we have here. Enhance? Oh, so you can say it. You're shitting me. I wouldn't know how. That whole sector must be crawling with guards. Hey, give me one reason why you think we could possibly break in. Más información. Have it. Do it. The Jack experience. The I am too, but working together, I think we have a shot. Great. Sign me up. I don't know how we're gonna get through this. Teamwork, that's how. Then you better have a damn good plan. Oh, it's killer. Behold, Helios. Okay, now how do we get there? Oh, well, well the Helios <laughs> is in space, so we need a spaceship, obviously. Well, we don't exactly have one lying around. 
Hey, what about Scooter? He said we could call him anytime. Well, you got yourself a rocket man, miss. Yeah. Now oh, you can do better than that. And then it's Putada. off to here. Putada. Fue el gatillo que no estaba... Ah, qué coraje me da el gatillo, tío. Pandora, we have liftoff. Lo tenía en modo corto. El corto no, no funciona en este juego. Well, why not call her now? Now the less she knows, the safer she is. Yvette, we're back. Awesome, Reese. You're a hero. I'll tell the guards to let you through. A ver, no va a ocurrir así. O sea, nada de esto, tío. Pero qué coño. Then I'll disable the security system. Está claro que no va a pasar nada de esto. Todo va para, todo va a pasar al revés. Eres genial, ¿sabes? You'll take Sasha and Gordis and go to the hub of heroism. Now, up on Helios, Jack's office is a museum, hallowed ground. Not even Vasquez had access. Looks like the only sure access is the VIP tour. Meet your new tour guides. From there, we'll get into Jack's office. We're all. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, you'll need me for that, obviously. Once inside, <laughs> Gordis will ID the piece. Wow! This place is huge! This way, please! And to the victors go the spoils. Told you. <laughs> Killer plan. Wait a minute. How are you gonna pull any of this off? Hyperion wants you dead. Then I better go as someone else. And for the grand finale, I'll digestruct a vast skies. Oh, Jack! Dentro de Reese, dentro de Vasquez. But Hyperion's gonna want proof that Reese is dead. We'll use Vasquez's body. They'll never know the difference. This could actually maybe work. So I guess so all that's gonna... left <laughs> is pitching the plan to Valerie. She'll go for it. And getting me to Old Haven. And I'll go to Scooters. Wait a second. Hmm? So, how did you figure out the pieces in Jack's office? Don't tell them, princess. They'll sabotage the whole freaking mission. It just came out of nowhere. Don't do it. You'll only make Vamos things a ser way sinceros. worse. Venga, me la juego. Okay, team. Um, prepare to have your minds blown. <laughs> Handsome Jack is in my head. God, but damn it! Did you just just allow me to explain? Hey, when I plug Nakayama's ID drive into my head port, I kind of accidentally uploaded an AI version of Jack into my brain. But, but it's cool. It's cool. I've I've got everything under control. <laughs> kind of. What? You had that murdering son of a bitch in your head all this time, and you didn't tell us? You asshole. And we thought August was a pro. <laughs> okay, if Jack's really in there, I want to talk to him. You know, just give him a piece of my mind. Yeah, that's not happening. But he'll only talk to me. Oh, how convenient. Well, that went over well. Even your oddly ripped moron sidekick took it better. Anyway, you know how it goes. Snitches get stitches. I just made that up. It's en algún momento se hubieran enterado de, de so esto y es mejor que there, se lo dijera yo antes de que. Jack. Lo descubrieran, porque seguro que lo acaban descubriendo en algún momento. Pero es que tiene que ver eso con, con que se haya copiado so, como si fuera culpa mía. So. Los personajes oh, de, de Delta, el tío, huh? se montan unas movidas. Say for argument's sake that you didn't mean to be a lying scumbag and that you understand that you should have shared what is an incredibly vital piece of information. So far, so good, I guess. Even if we could somehow trust you again, how can we trust Jack? No more lies. You need to level with us from here on out. Look, say what you will about Jack, but you gotta admit, he saved our asses back at that Atlas facility. Even if what you're saying is true, that doesn't mean we can trust him. Trust who? All right, 
Valerie signed off on the plan. Reese is going with Finch and Kroger. The rest of us are off to Hollow Point to get this thing spacey. Let's get to work. Y con esta pequeña discrepancia en el equipo vamos a ir terminando. Espero que os haya gustado el vídeo. Si es así, pues no te olvides de darle al like y suscribirte para estar más atento a la serie de Tales from the Borderlands. Hasta la próxima, campeones. Adiós.